Hello students, after discussing G-protein coupled receptors, ligand gated ion channels, transmembrane enzyme linked receptors, transmembrane JAK-STAT binding receptors, in today's video we are going to study fifth and the last category of transducer mechanisms that is receptors regulating gene expression. Now these receptors either facilitate or they inhibit the expression of specific genes and thus they modulate or they alter the response of a cell. Now this video is 13th in the series of videos on pharmacodynamics. Now as we all know transducer mechanism is a process by which an external signal in the form of ligand is received by the cell and it is converted into the cellular response. Now receptors that regulate gene expression are also called as the nuclear receptors. Now these receptors are also called as the transcription factor as they modulate the process of transcription. Now transcription is a process by which messenger RNA is produced from the DNA. Now very important these receptors are intracellular receptors. That means they are present either in the cytoplasm or they are present in the nucleus. Now this is the structure of a cell. Now here uh, this is the uh, uh, this is the receptor signaling gene expression. So this receptor is present here in the cytoplasm. So this is an intracellular receptor. That means it is not a cell surface receptor. It is not present on the uh, surface of the cell. It is not a transmembrane receptor, but it is a intracellular receptor. It is a receptor that is present uh, in the cytoplasm. It can also be a nuclear receptor where the receptor is present in the nucleus. Now this is a structure of a receptor that regulate gene expression also called as nuclear receptor. Now this receptor is present uh, inside the cell. It is present in the cytoplasm. So a ligand has to cross the cell membrane to reach the receptor. So ligands for this receptor are lipid soluble. So ligands are lipid soluble, uh, for example, steroidal hormones like glucocorticoids, mineralocorticoids, androgens, then vitamin A, vitamin D, etc. Uh, now this receptor is composed of different region. Now this uh, blue color region is the N-terminal domain. Now this red color region is the DNA binding domain. And it consists of two zinc fingers that bind to specific sequence of DNA called as HRE that is hormone response element. Now this green region it is a ligand binding region. It is a region where the ligand binds. Now this yellow region it is a hinge region and it connects DNA binding domain with the ligand binding domain and this is the C terminal domain. Now this is heat shock protein that is HSP90. Now heat shock protein 90 impose inhibitory effect on the nuclear receptor but as soon as the ligand binds to this receptor heat shock protein dissociates and the receptor becomes active. Uh, now this activated receptor changes its conformation. Now ligand uh, this ligand receptor uh, dimerizes and moves to the nucleus. Now in the nucleus is present uh, ligand uh, receptor dimer. Now uh, the DNA binding domain binds to coactivators or co-repressors which alter the process of transcription. Now transcription as already discussed is the process by which messenger RNA is produced from the DNA. Now co-activators increase the rate of transcription of genes while co-repressors inhibit transcription of genes. So now this complex binds to a specific sequence of DNA which is termed as hormone response element. Uh, now this uh, complex binds to specific DNA segment that is termed as hormone response element HRE. Now as per the signal received by the ligand, this complex either facilitate or it 
repress that is inhibit expression of specific genes so either the process of transcription is facilitated or the process of uh, transcription is repressed that is inhibited thus either specific messenger rna is synthesized or synthesis of messenger rna is inhibited now this messenger rna regulates synthesis of specific proteins by the ribosomes in the cytoplasm and thus modify cellular function so this is how receptors regulating gene expression produce the cellular or physiological response now this figure has been collected from a book essentials of medical pharmacology by kd tripathi so this is in brief on receptors regulating gene expression if you find the video useful kindly like subscribe and share this video thanks for watching this video